Alright, what is up you guys? As always, welcome back to another unfortunate random battle versus a team that I think looks really solid anyway. Couldn't find anybody to battle, that's usually my problem. However, Bayenshi is like awesome here, if anything kind of... If Greninja is not a lead, I think I'm fine. If it is the lead, then I guess I'm sad playing. I really like Mirage, is probably my best lead versus the majority of these mods. But I, I'm feeling, I'm feeling the, um, the Leopard being the lead, no, it's never gonna be. Nah, fuck it, let's do it. I mean, even if Greninja is the lead, could it kill me? I'm still a Dianchi, like I am a fat ass, bitch ass mon. With body press, that should be plenty enough to beat it. Anything else? Oh, actually Garchum kinda toys with me, I guess. <laughs> let's find out. Oh, you know what? Best possible lead. Don't have Steel Wing, right? Um, I think a Diamond Storm here directly. Uh, I do hope I force a switch. I'm not. That's not gonna do anything unless you freeze me. And Diamond Storm is gonna be plenty for me. More so if you get a defense raise. Which I don't. Leftovers. Huh. I was like, no, did I activate the weakness policy? That's not good. That's not what I want. So alright, I showed him the Diamond Storm, didn't get my defense raise. I guess I should have. Alright, Stealth Rocks then. Fine. Switches out, makes sense. Garganical is like a really solid Pokemon to bring in. And not something I want to see, by the way. Chomp. Good switch too. For all the wrong reasons. Take this! Um, <laughs> like this is a mod I fear because of Earthquake and Earthquake alone and if I switch out I can scale shot and just steamroll me. I really don't enjoy Earthquake on this team. Right, Mirage, let's do this. He has to go for Earthquake. Like the NC and Flygon in my book are like a really solid combination or even more so with real fucking spikes mate. Who runs spikes and also cool? Um, <laughs> let's see, he has a lot of floaters and no fairy, so Dragon Claw is not all that bad. I shouldn't take him out, however, which is gonna absolutely ruin me. But I'll take it. Great cool meet. Wow. Huh. For everything I planned for, you know, this wasn't it. I'll just say it as this. It was not a part of my initial plan. <sighs> I like Ifrit here. I really do. But Sceptile don't struggle all that much here either. But I want to activate Unburden if possible. It just this guy makes sense. It makes so much sense. They're gonna ban this guy. Of that I'm sure. Its speed here is just outrageous. Love it. And versus this team. If I get the speedster going, I should be... Maybe not fine, but I should be good. There he is! Hitting the scale shot! So that's a possibility! I had no idea. I had no idea. Nice. Gonna boost my speed, making Dragapult and um, Greninja not an option to switch in. But without the Dragon Dance, I'm really not that powerful. I should scare some things. Just gonna watch out for the Water Shuriken, which is luckily special. But yeah, Dragapult is not an issue, Dragonite is not an issue, Greninja is not an issue, that freaking kitty is not an issue. <laughs> can't remember the names of these guys. Switch in, yeah, the obvious. I like hurting things, let's do that. Real quick, you still do something. Not terrible, not terrible. Salt Cure. That's gonna be super effective, so that's gonna hurt anyway. You're being salt cured! I am! I mean, it hurts. And now, skill shot for the surprise switch out. Stays in. Alright. How much will I do? Just about nothing, really. Like I said, it's fine. I just want my expanding force to kick in anyway, so Sceptile can nope the team. I'm not against surprise crits, you know? I'm really not. 
Oh no! <laughs> you son of a bitch! <laughs> oh, should I? Maybe I should keep this guy alive then. Fine, I get it. <laughs> Not what I wanted to see, but I get it. Saving it for a sack plate in case of just by staying in and dying to soul cure, right? If I have to make a choice, and that's it. Salt skill, yeah. Nope. It hurts, but nope. Still, though, like, the aftermath of that move is still so amazing. He's just expanding falls here. Optimize my damage. Ooh! <laughs> That ain't, ain't it, bro. That ain't it. Still though, the kid is gonna come in. The kid has to come in. I think. No? Really? Really? Saving this guy then. Be free. Let's sack ya. <laughs> no? Oh, pretty sure the kid was gonna come in for all the right reasons All right, let's see extreme speed. No, not during this Not during this buddy. Not during my terrain That was more about surprise motherfucker uh, <laughs> Guess we recreating that skill shot then that was not supposed to happen still the kid is gonna kill me dead that's what they do. I mean, anything kill Inze at this point. Or the, the Paradox straight there tops, I don't know. I can't remember these guys' name, like... They got such a generic name, you kind of figure you would remember them, but you don't. You really don't. Like, it, it bothers me that I don't know what their names are. I realize that during this terrain, my opponent actually can't use uh, priority moves like I shot and whatnot. So ain't they kind of just nope the team right now? Granted, I missed or hit the scale shots, and it's kind of nice. It's actually really nice. <laughs> it's surprisingly great. Um, still though. It's not like I can optimize myself too much. Scale shot, I think, kills everything on the team anyway. Huh. Who knew that I, like Psychic Terrain would kind of um, put my opponent in the spot? I didn't necessarily think about it all that much myself. But now that I'm here, I'm <laughs> just like, whoa, right. This is a thing. Granted, I land my moves, that is. Come on, Ifrit! You were never supposed to work like this, but surprisingly, you did. Nope! Nope, 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 nope. I got myself a terrain. And I miss my moves, which is really unfortunate. I hate Scale Shot. <laughs> I really hate it. You know what? Since I missed that move, he had an opportunity to actually ruin me. Granted, he still can. I can still just go for four hits. Come on, five, five, five. Oh no. Oh no! Oh no! This is actually really alright. <laughs> Still no! <laughs> I wanted to save my Flare Blitz for the kitty. Let's see, Psychic Terrain is still active, which is awesome. That means that Mikereth is gonna get his uh, Unburden boost. Which is all I could ask for. About fucking time. Let's see, my terror type was what? Fire. He's a good rice beam, isn't he? You know what? Just because it's fun, let's save that one. Leaf Blade? Nope. Let's make this count. If my train was over now, I think we get. Yeah, 
now we get like the optimized scenario. He's like, yeah, I can ice shot this motherfucker. He can ice shot me. Now I'm just gonna nope him for that. Just about time, really. Septal getting his moment to shine. It's not often that happens. For obvious reasons, it's not that great. But for the scenario, surprisingly so. It really all depends though, but I'll still take it. I think Entei was still like the massive MVP here. Doing stuff, it, it, like going in for a sack play just to get out prioritized. You know what? That, that's how we want to work this guy in anyway. Let's go, Septal. Let's do this. Oh, didn't even go for eye shot. Then you're dead. Then you're dead, buddy. There we go. So I hope you guys really enjoyed this game. Been on the shortest time, I guess. Not really. Ten minutes. That's kind of clocking in. Very good time. And um, I hope to use this team a little bit more in the future. And that's it for watching. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Until then, as always, take care of one.